Hey, Namaskar everyone. How's everybody doing today? I'm not doing too bad, but uh, today I took a drive up to Erie, Pennsylvania. I'm actually in uh, Presque Isle today. Um, I'm at the uh, North Pier. And uh, it's a fishing pier over here. And uh, you can see today it just gets lined. It gets lined with fishermen. And uh, when we walk up here, I'll show you why I came to take a little walk. Um, again, the North Pier in Presque Isle. And uh, I'm gonna go check out the Erie Harbor North Pier light. Um, which uh, I guess they call it, some people call it the Presque Isle Pier Light. Um, it's, let me turn this around. Better view over here. Um, it's one of three lights that are in Erie. We're not worried about the other ones though. We are worried about the one we're walking out to. Over there. That one. We're worried about that one. Um, like I said, there's one of three lighthouses in Erie. Uh, actually, I would say four because there's a water, a waterworks light that's uh, at one of the marinas back, but I, I don't think that counts. But there's the Presque Isle Lighthouse, the old uh land lighthouse and then this one which was the north pier light um well it's quiet today it's real quiet today All right, and like I said, we're not worried about the other, we're not worried about doing a video on Presque Isle itself. We're not worried about the other lighthouses. We're worried about this one today. That one right there. I love these lighthouses. I'm gonna call it a lighthouse. It's considered a light, but we'll call it a lighthouse because you can actually, well, we can't, but uh, you know, you can get inside there. So it's a lighthouse. Um, but to get here, you follow this to, there's the Coast Guard Station. It's by the Coast Guard Station. Um, and then there's there's a, a spot, uh, there's a bunch of houseboats that you'll pass too, which is it's an awesome ride out here. It's pretty cool. It's kind of gloomy today. I wish it was a little nicer out, but eh, what are you gonna do? Um, and over over there, I don't know if you can see them cranes over there. And there's a couple buildings over there. That's a campground over there. Um, it's a small campground. It's more of a fisher, uh, kind of a fisherman campground, but uh, I haven't hit that one yet, but I, I think I'm going to this year just so the kids can go fishing out here. But uh, yeah, man, I wish there was some barges coming in here. That'd be a pretty cool sight. Let's see what's this. Surface is uneven, slippery when wet or icy. There was a fish over there that just jumped. No swimming or diving. All right. Nobody got their swimsuits on anyway, right? All right. We're good then. All right. A little bit about this lighthouse. We already know that it's one of the three lighthouses out here. It, uh, again, we already know it's in Presque Isle, Erie, Pennsylvania. Um, it's a metal lighthouse. It's a square 
pyramidal lighthouse and that's uh that's kind of very unique for being a lighthouse 34 feet high opened in 1858 and uh i believe it has a fourth a fourth fresnel lens in it lens in it and it's actually that was taken out i think in 1995 i believe and it's at the erie maritime museum so it uh the, the fresnel lens not in there we can't go inside it um but if we were able to get inside it there would be a ladder to get up top and uh that's what we would be doing but we can't man i'm surprised there's nobody out here like i said this is a big fishing pier and uh and we got it all to ourselves today so yeah man really really quiet here i'm gonna do a pan uh here so you can i'll give you the whole 360 view and, and uh i'll shut up for a minute so you can see the view There we go. Yeah, sometimes the barges come in like over here and they'll kind of just dock right in there. Yeah, he's enjoying his day too. Yeah, so I figured we'd do a little simple video today. Nothing wrong with that, right? I come up here quite often, so we'll hit the rest another day. I'll probably be up here about 10 more times this year. I'll get a little closer, though, and uh, we'll take a look at some of the detail of the light. you can have on the docks and on the piers there it is there it is yep we'll go up close I'll show you that it's metal the black and white stripes would be nice to go in there See if anybody's home. Hello? Nobody's home. But this this light been moved a bunch of time, like three or four times it's been moved. And it's been in this spot uh since 1940. 1940. It stayed right here. This is the last spot it, it was in. Um but yeah, too bad it's closed up. This would be pretty neat to go inside. Be nice to go up there, right? Ah, okay. All right. You're okay. You're okay for watching my channel. smokestacks out there there's some people fishing out lake's real calm today here's the other another ladder we don't want to fall in there do we Oh, we need to have a fish to come up here. Big old shark. 
one of them Lake Erie sharks. Okay, let's go back up here. All right, so that was the little short video. Um, I'm gonna end this here because I'm just gonna I'm gonna stay out here for a while and uh enjoy the silence enjoy the view but yeah again to recap this is where did i say the north pier erie harbor light or the presque isle harbor light whatever you want to call it um metal square pyramidal shape Fresnel Lend is not in it. It's at the Erie Time Museum. It was moved here in 1940, and this is the place it stayed after being moved three or four times. Um, so, yeah, if you want to take a little day trip, if you fish, definitely hit this spot. Uh, that This whole pier is nothing but fishing. Um, yeah, and while you're here, uh, check out the other lighthouses. Actually, the Presque Isle Lighthouse is is on the way back i'm gonna wait until it opens though it's not open uh you can't go inside it um because of the corona stuff going on still but when it opens that's when i'll do a video about it because you can actually go inside you'll go up the steps um so yeah that'll be a whole nother a whole nother thing we'll do but yeah come on up uh you know, if you can't, that's what I'm doing this for, so you can kind of take a day trip without leaving the house. What do you think? Pretty cool, right? That you can walk out here, or on the water, and you get to see uh, something some people might not even uh, know it's here. But yeah, again, I'm not walking back. I'm going to end the video here and just uh, take a little break today. All right. Hey, thanks for watching. I always appreciate it. Um, and this is Jim Mueller with Everyday Adventures with Jim. Fair